Yeah. The other thing is I'm worried about your bow. I think your bow scratches. <laughs> Not very good. And a friend of mine came round to test some bows. I've got two tests for a bow. <laughs> One is this. In the Bruch Concerto, slow movement. And the other is in the Paganini Caprice. That's it. So he came with this. I said, please don't tell me what the bows are. I don't want to know. So I played like this. A la poubelle, which is France for into the dustbin. Next one, into the dustbin. It went on like that for about half an hour with six bows. Apparently I had thrown to the dustbin a quarter of a million pounds worth of bows. Tourte, two tourte bows, the greatest bows of all time. I said, well, they're just rubbish, they don't play. This bow, which I'm using, my bow hair man wouldn't replace the hair because it's Brazilian boxwood and it's valueless. It's not worth 20 pounds. Anyone who touches this bow says it's pure genius. It's not me, it's the bow. This. You can press as hard as you like and it will not scratch, even if you say, please scratch. People kill for this bow and it's valueless. And idiots are spending hundreds of thousands of dollars and pounds on tourte bows and they don't work. Stupid. This, we'll have to get another bow. Try doing that. Take this. This valueless bow. It's worth pence, according to the great, uh, the great luthier of the world. Press vertically. Yeah. Right, now play. It doesn't scratch. Yes? Isn't it marvellous? Amazing! Isn't it amazing? Yes, well you can't have it. Can we swap? One of my teachers had this as a joke and he said, do you really want it? I said, yes, he said, you can take it as a present. I didn't realise that. Uh, if you get it re -haired. people laugh at it because it's warped. It's what's called Brazilian boxwood and it's really not worth more than 10 or 15 pounds. Right, well that's not bad for a fool. Now, why don't you show something nice about Nicholas? Nobody's noticed he's not wearing a shoulder rest. Can you go round the back and see that there's a huge gap between that and there? And he's done that in two weeks. Two weeks ago he had a shoulder rest. I didn't force him to do it. It's a big problem, shoulder rest, because people get clinged to their shoulder rest when they take it off the violin and bobbles and they can't play. And he's managed to get onto his thumb and base of the first finger in one week that from here it looks as if he's got a massive shoulder rest. It's absolutely perfect. It's the best thing I've ever had for a conversion. He's on the bow and there's nothing there. No shoulder going up. Correct. And it's extremely difficult. I'm impressed with him for that. One compliment. Now, can I have the rest, please? Oh. No, you didn't put the elbow down on the up. No, I was just talking to the air. By the way, most of my pupils come from different cultures. Greeks, Bulgarians, Turks, Koreans. Someone now is going to come from Brazil. It doesn't work for the Anglo-Saxons. They think I'm nasty, they think I'm abrupt, they think I'm aggressive, and they leap. What's that? Finish your sentence. Is that my computer? Someone phoning me? Who is that phone? Turn it off! <laughs> and, uh... For those people who understand what I'm talking about, like people who still respect family values or still respect God, they'll understand the hierarchy of the discipline of a teacher to a student, then I'm the right teacher for them. If it's the Anglo-Saxons and they think that I'm being too abrupt and too aggressive and he can't play and he's shouting and he hit the pupil and he's abusive, all the rest of it, stay away, I don't want to have it. I've been doing it for 30 years. I'm really too pleased not to have it. This guy is brilliant. He's brilliant, he's very good, he understands Greek Orthodox... Uh, theology backwards, because his family background is very high up in the Greek Orthodox Church. 
and uh, they respect family values, so it's no problem. You see, he laughs when I shout at him. Now, again, please, if you do this upvote wrong, I will simply kill you. It's simple. That's his promise. It's not even a threat. You will be dead. Why are you t looking at me? So you can get to look at him? <laughs> I have to direct the cameraman here as well. Everything in the Western world is useless. <laughs> no! You did perfect, it's an E flat! The E flat you went up! The others were perfect, you ruined it! That's the danger of progress. You make progress and then the disappointment is, in is intolerable. I couldn't tolerate my own disappointment. It was good. It was really good. And then you fucked it up! Why do I use the F word on YouTube wearing a yarmulke as an Orthodox Jew? You all want to know, because there is no better word to describe my feelings. Say, you made a mess of it and you disappointed me. The euphemisms are worse. You've got to say, fucked it up, because you've got to be fucked it up! The only expression, music is about expressing human emotions. Not covering them up with false emotions and say, well, I was slightly disappointed that you made progress in the first two, but on the third when you didn't, so it's so disappointing. All of that Anglo crap. Now, let's get this going again. Sharp is a lower finger. You can do this one because it's a lower finger, but this one is an upper finger. So it's coming from on high. So it's on high. Your brain is, is, is linked. Your left arm and right arm is linked. You did it perfectly. This here, a lower finger. So you could do lower there. This time it's a higher finger. So you went up with a finger. Ah 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 ah. The bomb is completely different from the left hand because I was trying to work out why can you do it perfectly? Then you didn't do it perfectly. You understand what I've said? I do, but mentally, yes. I also linked it to crossing strings. Well, I'm not interested in your mental problems. No, <laughs> he, can, he can speak. From <laughs> that, <laughs> <laughs> Good, you didn't take it. Now, this time you'll do it. For the camera, Mummy's watching. All smile for Mummy. The E flat, you will drop that. <laughs> you hit so I'm about the elbow movement. This. It's very slow. That's quite slow. I'm talking about the elbow movement. This. That. Uh, strangling, nearly to strangle. This moves very slowly. I've got a very specific interpretation of this opening. If you look on YouTube, the worst, unfortunately, is Colgan. He's doing this. No, no, no. 